Hey, what's happening gamers? Welcome to a look at the station brought to you by our uh, network Freedom. So thank you again Freedom for a copy of the game. Also, we have a special discount for those of you that uh, want to play this game on Steam. It's located in our description. It says special discount. I believe it's 40% off. Uh, so you can go and check out the game for yourself. I've never played this. I don't know what's going on. But we also are giving away codes of the game live today uh, for Steam. I'm playing this on the PS4. This is a survival, like, sci-fi T-rated game. That's all I know. And uh, you're on a station in space. So we're going to play about an hour of the game and, uh, yeah, do some giveaways. So how's everybody doing tonight? I've been away for a while. I had that uh, thing in New York City. Hi, Kaywing. I know I'm, I'm going to be on the stream soon. I'm just lollygagging over here. You're, you're eating a late dinner. <laughs> yep. Oh, my gosh. So, how this giveaway is going to work is... Uh, <laughs> liking the video and then i'm gonna have to have you guys go over to twitter and i will follow uh the person and uh we're gonna give away stuff live so that way it's, i don't accidentally give the codes uh away to people who didn't win them because it's it's really complex and all that fun stuff Well, you'll have to look at the chat. I'm going to have people follow me on Twitter. I'm going to I'm making a thing on Twitter right now. Cool. And I will help you with that. How many millions of hours have been spent studying space in the pursuit of finding life in the universe? So, what would happen if we found it? Not bacteria or an invertebrate, but an entire sentient alien civilization. Questions we've been asking since the beginning of time could finally be answered. But what if the alien species was discovered in a planet-wide civil war? Imagine the debate that would start. Fear is blinding us. Everything our society has done has led us to this very moment. We can't ignore this. What safety and security will be found in contacting a violent alien race? Is this worth risking our safety, our security? As a compromise, a three-person team on board an undetectable space station is sent to research the alien world. Halfway through the mission, the space station's communication, navigation, stealth, everything mysteriously shuts down. Proof that we were spying on a potentially violent alien civilization now floats helplessly above them. In a panic to understand what happened, a recon specialist is sent to investigate and coordinate a rescue with the crew. Okay, so Amber's eating salad in the background if you hear her, and uh, i actually kind of interested in this now. We have full control. I got my contest up. If you guys want to uh, enter Welcome it, you just like this video. Uh, thank you, female Hal. Down you go. 
And like I said, this is a sci-fi, basically, adventure game inside of the station that's been attacked by aliens. Or something like that, or sabotaged by aliens, I don't know. Oops. Picking up floating cylinders, Initiating sticking scanning. them here. Scan complete. Augmented reality systems now available. Yeah, it's an adventure game from a first person point of view. To the critics of this mission, I say it's not sufficient you voice your concerns of danger or ethics. If you are against progress in this moment, you must acknowledge that our very understandings of biology, chemistry, physics, even religion are thrown into question, and you stand in our way. I'm getting kind of a Star Trek vibe from this, a little bit. Like, Next Generation, or maybe uh, Deep Space Nine. Because we're on this uh, space station. There's no people here. Uh, I think that's what the mystery is going to be. Looks like there was a heck of a party here. Uh... Oh, it's like one of those uh, lights, the circle light things. Yeah, very future-like. We're playing a type of card game. It's almost like everybody in the entire place was like vaporized or something like that because the furniture is all still in place, but there's no people here. Nope, I can't open the door yet. Freaky! Yep, somebody was in a hurry and spilt their drink. Wait, what? Probably need to use some type of gadget to uh, open this. There's no run button either. I don't even know if I'm a human. Whoa! Okay, that's how I came in here. There's no mirror or anything. Oh, audio logs. Don't know how I open that. Let's close that. Interesting. Nope, that's the map again. We'll close that. Wish it was a little bit more straightforward, uh, what to do, but, I mean, it looks pretty cool. This game is available on Steam, and the codes that we're giving away are for Steam. Okay, so those are, like, little tidbits about what to do. This area's been sealed off. So when I go here, I can click and learn about stuff. Lounge power. So I need to find a way to activate the power. Turn off the power override. Okay, so where's the power override button? Would this be the power override button? Okay, open it. Ah! Yeah, this would have been better as like a VR thing. There we go. And then just... <laughs> no, I'm, I'm still playing it. Alright, I turned off the power. Oh, whoa! Oh, that's just a, that's a dude in a spaceship suit. Just hanging out up there. No aliens. Do I get a weapon or is it just... 
walking around. Hey guys. Yeah, I'm totally slacking off. I don't know. Sorry. Walker room. So I'll help you with any kind of code giveaways. Yep, we're gonna be doing it on Twitter though. Okay. Huh, that's some type of weird laundry machine. Okay. And um, this is my first time looking at this game, if people are wondering. Are they supposed to like your tweet, or are they supposed to like your video? Like the video, and then leave a comment on the tweet. Where it says, oh. WHOA! Right. Why, why am I running? <laughs> why are you running? Yes, why are you running? I have no idea where I'm Return going. tools to retrieve ID bracelet. So, here then? Life support systems are currently offline. <gasps> oh, wow. What does that mean? Is there air? Uh, I don't know. I don't even know if I'm a human or an android or what. Just pressing random buttons and stuff. Yeah, I think that's what it is, just exploring. What is that thing for? Eh, I guess we'll just push it up. Video gaming, so I'm in the contest now. What is all this stuff? Weird looking. Anthony says, Hello, Anthony Chong. Thanks for being um, a sponsor. And we've got Ruga here, too, and a bunch of people, and Miles. Hey, Miles. And everyone in the chat, thanks so much for coming by. <clears throat> so, Anthony says the glowing blue orbs are logs, right? Yep. Mm. Oh my gosh, this reminds me of that um, movie that came out a while ago where everyone, like, was supposed to wake up when they got, like, so many light years away from Earth, but then somebody's, like, pod, like, they woke up on accident, and it was, like, 75 years before they were supposed to. This isn't a, um, spaceship, though. We're, we're in a, um space station that's orbiting the earth and oh. may or may not have been attacked by aliens or something i don't know cool open here <laughs> oh ruka is finally back from his slumber oh cool thanks thanks vic no problem we didn't no problem thanks for coming by hmm <clears throat> interesting but yeah i think probably this game should have been vr based i mean it it's cool and everything, I just don't... I don't know. It feels very VR-like, and I think the controls would work better VR-wise. What's this? Did they make it for VR, too? Or? Don't know. <sighs> okay, Drinking when something breaks, rolls. one drink. Alright, let's go to a different room. Yeah, so... Yeah, K-Wing hasn't been feeling well for a while, but he oh, I've been up. I've been kind of out of it, and I hope you guys have been enjoying the uh, Scribblenauts preview. We have uh, two more videos of Scribblenauts. We have one tomorrow and then one Friday. Mm -hmm. And that, I believe, is all we can show until the game comes out on March 6th. EMS station. What is that? Oh, right. Halfway to the alien civilization, a, a malfunction occurred. Yeah, I don't know if that you're talking about the same movie, but yeah. Yeah, I think you are. So, yeah, definitely. Hello, Eric. How's it going? <laughs> Ruga says, it's a drinking grain. Grabs apple juice. Oh my gosh. I have green tea here because I got some green tea snapples for Welcome, a loop before. Mina. And I ate all of them. Sorry. There's no one Mila's room. I am not Mila. Am I Mila? Yep, they 
basically it's Wally too. I wonder if everybody was vaporized. There's like no people, other than that one person walking around in a space suit. Well, if the air was shut off and nobody could breathe, he would still see people around. Yeah. Maybe they all got beamed somewhere. This is a nice closet. I know, right? Look at the entire closet. It's Built right wall. into the side of the wall, yeah. Wow, that's my future closet. Check out this log. There's no real achievement possible for the daughter of a hero. I don't wish to seem ungrateful, but it's getting cold in the shadow you cast on me, father. Life is tough, but so are you. Let's break the glass. <laughs> she has a little motivational thing for herself. Oh, what do we got here? Mission calendar. There's something crossed out on it. Yeah, I can't make it out, though. Probably be important. Some type of trophy. Don't mind me breaking and entering. Erase air freshener. Interesting. Some freaky's gonna happen. It has to. This what? is just. I don't know. This is very relaxed. I mean, just kind of exploring. There's no consequences. I mean, at least at the beginning of the game, you'd think that there'd be like flashing lights, like getting a pod or something before the life support is gone. But nope. Just kind of exploring. Hello, Mila. You missed yesterday's workout. Is everything okay? There you go, Amber. It's what? an exercise machine that like keeps track of everything you do, like Wii Fit, except like. That's cool. I loved Wii Fit. Yeah. Oh, that was great. It's a cool watch. I don't think Milo knew that anymore. I really liked Wii Fit. You know what I loved about it? It was so encouraging. You know, like other regular exercise programs, they just tell you, you know, what you're doing. But Wii Fit would always be like, you almost, you're almost there. You can do some more. Good job. You're doing great. They would just keep saying like how great you were doing all the time. And I was like, yes, I'm doing it. Becoming mighty. I should do that again. I liked the Wii Fit jog thing. That was cool. And the bicycle riding. Hmm. Messages? Mila. Scroll. Go through this. This is a pretty cool futuristic looking thing though. Yeah. I mean, it looks pretty sleek and nice. Notes. And remember, if you guys want to check out this game for yourself, uh, non-contest-wise, we have a special discount that we're doing with the game. And you can check that out in the discount uh, thing in the description for this video. Uh, Anthony says, is it a memorial to her father? Question mark. Don't know. Mm -hmm. I mean, her father was a, a hero, apparently. Oh, this happened a little while ago. I'm hearing uh, through the grapevine about accusations some senators were bribed. Any truth to this? Uh, it's probably... Uh, no, from... Worry about things that you're paid to worry about. Ooh. Ouch. Sounds like somebody got rid of all the people here. Oh, Future Magazines! Business culture. What's that? Examine. Phone. Think that's a phone? I don't know. What is this? R R one and R. It's a. It's a future book. Can't tell. It's a book. It's a book. It says a title on the side. Uh, 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 I can't. No, no, no! I won't try to read it. I can... How can you read that? Because I can't even. Okay, I'm going up to the screen. Luke, I can literally. Enemies of the future? Yeah. Enemies of the future is what it says. Maybe I should put it back in her bookcase. You're like ruining the crime scene here. If there is a crime. The only crime here is I'm terrible at putting books. There. The shelf. Let's... No, your bookshelf looks nice, except for I need to dust it. Let's leave uh, Mila's. Well, that's Mila's bedroom again. Man. Please, nothing freaky happen. Everything here looks so cool. I wish this was my room. I can't believe you hid this from me for so long. 
Silas Hayes is the mystery man you've been seeing for the last half year. The guy you're going on the Psy Prime mission with. You'd be in so much trouble if you two were caught. I always see him in interviews, but what's he like in person? I'll try to read one of his books so we can hold a real conversation when you finally introduce me. Does he have an interesting side to him? Or will you just be talking about his favorite kind of rocks? Meet up when you're back. Amelia. Oh, it's one of her friends that wants to meet Amelia's, Amelia's boyfriend. Oh my gosh! Another weird book. Monument of Honor. Yeah. So that one says Monument of Honor. That's kind of a cool wall. All right, let's leave this thing. What does this do? I think if I lived here, though, like the the fluorescent lights would bother me after a while. Oh yeah, totally. <laughs> it looks cool for now. But... Get to the escape pod. What? Somebody said valid, get. You have a valid ID bracelet. I do. It says valid ID bracelet detected. You must have an ID bracelet. Deploy maintenance robot to repair life support. Uh. I don't think we need life support. We'll be. Fine. We don't. We'll be fine. I'm never good in these life or death situations. Oh, what does that say over there? Where? So. At present, given the details you have provided, we are unable to approve the loan for which you have recently applied. In the absence of collateral to secure the amount requested, our institution would consider a smaller principal loan on a cash flow basis. This would require a consistent employment contract. We appreciate your interest and hope to do business with you in the future. Cademan somebody. Okay. Alright, well I'm going to check on Twitter and see what kind of people replied to your post. To restore life support in order to leave. Access denied. Valid ID detected. Deploy maintenance robot to finish. Oh. Yep, somebody said, oh no, K Wife is trying to win the giveaway from D Guards Gaming. Yep, I am trying to win it. I'm becoming the teacher's pet. Access key required. Uh, what does an access key look like? Ooh, this is new. Whoa! What happened? I don't know. I think the station is falling apart. I'm constantly dealing with your pa passive aggression. Deal with this. Okay. Alright, now things look a little jumbled. That pan is not on the stove. That food is left there. The analysis of the terra firma is complete. It's only Silas's taxonomy of the alien anatomy that is behind schedule, which is surprising given how similar... Aiden, what are you doing? That wasn't me. I'm on my way to engineering now. Call me at the bridge when you get there. Huh. Oh, wow. We have a lot of comments on your tweet, honey. Cool. So, how do you want me to do this? Pick a person randomly? Like, scroll my finger up and down? Or... Yep. We'll so do that, just... and then I'll send them a code, like, uh, through the, uh, the DM. So, you want me to, like, swing all these comments and then just put my finger on one? Yep. Okay. All right, so we're going to pick the first winner then. All right, guys, Look, so it's none I am of my business. Oh, sorry. I know you ended whatever was between you and Mila. But the way you still look at her, I'm not convinced you're over her. You're absolutely right, Aiden. It is none of your business. Interesting. So this is like a a ship's uh, kind of break room or something. Yeah, are they still talking or no? No, they're not talking anymore. Um, so how do I send them the code? Do you want me to type the code to them? Okay. No, nope. I have the code. Oh, if I tell them that they win, then I just you have follow to... them, and then I have to type the code to them in their text. No, no, because someone could steal that. You have to follow them, and then you would message them. Yeah, that's what I mean. Okay. Okay. All right, so I'm just going to swing my finger and basically hit the first person I see. Or the first person I land on. All right, ready, Luke? Yeah. And reminder, these are codes for Steam. So, All right, yeah. so number one. Whoop. All right, who am I on? Uh, you're on a GIF guy. Okay, it says Star Noor. Star Noor? Uh, Star Noor. I landed on you. And so I will follow this person. Uh, 
Are you on my account or yours? Oh, well, I'm following them on my account, but you can do it on yours if you want. Yeah. Okay, so we did the break room thing. I'm just loading up my Twitter people to take a few minutes. Alright, do you want me to pick a second person? No, because uh, I can only do one person at a time. Ah, okay. Alright guys, so... I'm not a robot. You guys have to keep watching. Yep, I'll announce the other winner in uh, probably ten minutes or so. Okay. And verified by K-Wing and myself. I'm just doing this totally randomly by just like looking away from my phone and just like landing on a... On a tweet. No idea what this is. But make sure to reply to Luke's tweet and also like this video if you guys want to code for this game. And is this on what system is on this on again, Luke? It's on Steam and PS4. We're playing on the PS4 and we're giving away copies for uh, uh. Steam and oh wait, hang on. No, okay. Uh, the discount is for Steam. The codes are for PS4. Alright, so we are giving away codes for PS4, guys. My bad. Sorry about that. Lack of sleep. But you guys can get this discounted on Steam, so... Yes, the Sorry discount about... is for Steam. Uh... Hopefully the people that commented have a PS4. <laughs> yeah. I have to go through and do that again. What is this? Um, I can just write something down, like, I can just, like, reply to your comment and just say, the codes are for... Whoa! Is that... Just throw this stuff out? Oh. Nope. Just can't throw it out randomly. A mentor once told me that within every great leader is a person of strength. But what is strength without honor? And what is honor without glory? That's a good question. I won't get more sleep, guys, as long as I'm working on Monster Hunter. <laughs> I know, right? Monster Hunter keeps me very busy and lack of sleep. Alright, so where are we? In like a garden area of the ship? What are those weird cell phone things? Yeah, it's basically a cell phone. Nope, that's a game system. Yeah, that's a game system. Cool. Okay, so we need to build a robot in order to leave and go to the next area of the station. At least I think that's what we need to do. Just waiting for more freaky stuff to happen. This is off limits. Need ID bracelet. Okay, let's go back up the stairs. Dun dun dun. No, no freaky stuff yet. Sweet. I don't deal well with jump things. I love jump scares. They make me feel happy. You love jump scares? No, no. I don't. No, I don't. I don't love them. My adrenaline shoots up. It feels like someone stabbed me with a knife. That's all. It actually hurts for my adrenaline to go up that much. I don't like it. I scare Welcome, very Aiden. Easily. <laughs> Wait, can... am I Aiden? No, I'm not Aiden. I don't even know who I am. I'm just some random guy that lives here. I can... Apparently Aiden, uh... Liked Milla, and his room is kind of. Well, it's a guy's room. It's a mess. Action. Wait a second. So that means the way that I keep my areas is basically like a guy's. Uh. Wait, 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 wait. wait. What did that say? Go back to the notes. It had something important. Well, 
When everything looks like a nail, you'll always need a hammer. That's probably what the password is. Mail. And what else we got? Messaging. Okay. Yeah, Aiden's place is a mess. Oh, time to hear from Aiden himself. I never liked space. It's cold, lonely, and gives a man too much time to think. Time to think about what you've done and what you shouldn't have. Wow, this Aiden guy was lazy. He's got a spider robot typing on probably, I don't know. It's the first moving thing I've seen. Trying to examine, can't see it. I don't know what this is. It's a box of some kind. Everything you find should be important though, right? I will keep daddy safe. It's a monster. Nope. Which of these things are not like the others? Stick that there for now. Keep daddy safe, huh? Wait. I will keep dad safe. Kibo will keep dad safe. Kibo? What's a Kibo? You don't want to know, Luke. Wait, is that like the diagram of what your suit looks like? No idea. We don't even know if I'm wearing a space suit because people keep telling me to run. <gasps> waffles, waffles, waffles. Where? Waffles, waffles, waffles. Where's waffles? Up there. Waffles? Waffles. Oh, waffles never breaks down. They yeah. never break down. Waffles never quit. <laughs> They're always there for breakfast when you need them. Punching bag reports. Alright, mm -hmm. so this was Aiden's room. Fun. It seems like a cool guy. Fun guy. Whoa. You know what? I don't really need to live on Earth. I'd rather live somewhere here with cold hard steel everywhere around me. Life support systems in A3 are currently offline. Exterior damage detect exterior damage detected. Access restricted until maintenance robot you have to we have to find the maintenance robot. Maintenance robot's over here. We have to deploy him. Wait, where'd he go? We're supposed to find the maintenance ro robot and deploy him. Magnet tool station. <clears throat> What's this? Hmm. Is that the robot? It doesn't look like he's in the best shape. Maybe we have to fix him. Well, how's that gonna happen? Maybe we have to click on that thing next to him. Re configure spatial accelerometer. Install firmware on encoder. Replace E40 voltage regular and replace the 35 inch synapses fuse. It's simple, see? That's all you have to oh, do. Oh, yeah, that's great. That's simple. <laughs> I have no idea what they're talking about. <laughs> it's not like I found any items that actually... It tells you right there how to do it, Luke. I can't believe that you don't know how to restore the synapsis fuse thing. That's, that's great, it's Amber. It says open here. What do you think I'm trying to do? Try opening it. You have to go through all these different people's rooms and try to find these pieces. Oh, my gosh. I don't know. I guess we'll try that magnetic tool. You would think that they would have everything that Maybe you need the right in this area. Maybe the tool could open that chest. Give him a bottle, like fine wine. And some apple juice. Oh, okay. Space apple juice. Well, it would probably turn into wine if it was there for a long time. It might not be good though. Signed out to Aiden. Aiden has that. I think you need whatever that is. Status locked. <laughs> but I know I know the password. It's a hammer. It's a hammer. I feel like we're just going to be jumping around this spaceship for hours doing nothing. Why don't you just use somebody else's thing? What are you talking about? I don't know. Like what what exactly are you like going through methodically or are you just like jumping around? No idea what I'm doing. I'm just running around. 
All right, well, that's a great plan. Yep. Well, that one is open. Try looking in there. I did. Well, do you want me to try it or no? Nope. Okay, I'll just sit here and watch you. It's the same result. It already shows you what you can click on. You click with the R1 button, and there's really nothing else. All right, well... I'm so itching to try to see if I can try it. All right, so there was something in this room that looked like it was important, and I threw it over here. It doesn't tell you what it is, though. See, this is why I always tell you I don't like point-and-click games, because... No, there are point-and-click games that tell you what you need to do like have you looked at every glowing thing that you're able yep, to look at i've touched every no i mean like every single thing that has a little that little robot there in the middle had something you could have clicked on for information no he didn't he's just there, sitting there that typing right there. that screen oh no okay this is the only thing you can pick up and it doesn't see that looks like aiden's thing yeah, it looks like something for Aiden, but when you pick it up, it doesn't tell you what it is. So. You should take it out of the room. Mm. Like, at other point-and-click games, usually when you pick something up, it's like, Aha! Uh -huh, this is what I need for this area, and then you All just right. have to remember where the maintenance area is. This is called the station, right? There's no walkthrough on it yet, it just came out. Um, do you want me to send the code to the winner, or no? Yeah. How do I do that? You told me I'm not allowed to follow them. I'll follow them and send them. All right, well, why don't I walk around while you do that? All right, I'm gonna try this. Oh. Oops. Oh, here's the map. There's audio logs. It says that we're supposed to find Mila's ID bracelet. I already have it. Okay, restore power to the lounge room. Current objectives. Locate the crew. Find Aiden. Find. Oh, you have to find Aiden. Find Scylla's You're Hayes. You're jumping ahead of time, though. The no, these thing, are our current objectives. You're not going to find them, though. You have to. Never mind. You have to do the maintenance robot first. Repair maintenance robot. Access the bridge. Deploy maintenance robot. Oh. Okay. Mila's ID bracelet. Okay. Well, we have a lot of audio logs. Alright, so we do know what we're doing. Sorry. Alright, first code has been sent to uh, Star Noor, who has it on PS4. Boom. Yay, thank you very much, Star Noor, for entering, and thank you, everybody. I see all of your tweets there. Sorry for being a backseat gamer. The first thing you have to do is activate the maintenance robot somehow. And you're going to have to right, find well, random my... parts. Because sometimes my brain thinks different than yours and we can work together. Sure, the aliens are a bit savage, but I see no need to condemn them for it. Think about us. Our people crawled out of a violent past, so I wager they too can change. Don't you? I doubt it. The past is always present. There might be a robot arm in Aiden's room. Oh. Well, I'm just doing nothing with this stuff. I'm just gonna put this on the table. I'll let you go to Aiden's room. 
I actually brought a tool in here from Aiden's room, but it didn't say robot arm. It looked like a laser gun. I think we're doing a great job, honey. Mm, no. Well, you did a good job giving away that code. That's what matters. We run around and we look for the codes. Let's go find a robot arm. This is from Aiden's room. It's not going on the robot. See? This is what I'm talking about. We should just grab all the stuff laying around on the ground and then bring it all into this room. Meh. And use all of it. See which ones of it work. This is not Aiden's room. You know what this reminds me of? Remember when I was going to get you that really cool lit up bookcase for all your DVDs and games in the front, like near your TV? Mm hmm. On Amazon. But then we didn't get it because we had to move. <gasps> oh, have you been up here? Need Aiden's bracelet. Oh, try going on the doors. Did you not see what this says? Oh, this is okay. the door. All right. Means you can't open okay, it right okay, okay. now. So. Mm -hmm. Thank you for following us. Super dot. I have to find Ooh, Aiden's room stuff again. Over there. No, there's nothing there. It's over there, over to the left. There. That's oh. inside that room. Oh. Okay, I just saw shiny stuff. Yep, yeah, shiny stuff is not gonna help us. Oh. All right, so we need. It doesn't say anything about an arm, though. Why would they say... It says you need the synapsis fuse and the voltage regulator. So if we find something that says synapsis fuse or voltage regulator, then we know. So let's just look at everything and, and look at it. And then it's, it's one of those two things. I have to remember, synapsis fuse... It doesn't tell you what they are when you pick them regulator. up. It doesn't tell you. That doesn't help. This much. is what I'm saying. This is why this is not a amazing point and click game it's okay <gasps> there's something yeah that's something but it's not going to tell you oh, what this is it's r1 and l1 to examine still doesn't tell you what it is i don't see you examining it <sighs> oh that's examining that's it? all examine does okay well maybe that's it no maybe it is though. this is a gun of some kind maybe that's a synapsis fuse nope Ooh, it's going no, purple it's, there. Nope, it's not doing anything ever. There we go. Ah, fun. Oh. Never give up, never surrender. So oh, I'm only doing an hour of this. I, that's as much as I can take. Alright, so... Hopefully we'll get the robot built. If not, oh well. Yeah, um... Yeah, and just bear in mind, guys, this is a family-friendly uh, chat, so please, um, no, like, please keep it PG and just be excellent to each other. Thanks so much, guys. Mm. Eric says, I'm wondering on the story of this game so far. I guess that's the mystery, Eric. Oh, oh, Anthony says, Luke, you have two of those signed out tools. Those tools that, um, that, that guy said were signed out. I think you have to put them back where they were, because they were signed out. You could put them back where they were. You know what I'm saying? Nope. Okay, you know where it says that, what's his name, Alex, signed them out? Aiden? Mm -hmm. You can put those two things that you thought, you, you thought were supposed to go on the robot, you can put those back in those slots. What slots? The cubby holes underneath the signed out thing. Okay. There we go. This is Aiden's room. Right. There's some type of gadget in here that goes on the robot. And there. Arm. That's all it did. You can't grab it. Oh, that's another. Well, why don't we try putting those things in those slots? You know where it says that different people is different tools, and Aiden signed out his tools. Remember that place? Vaguely. Yeah, you have to put those two tools that um, our chat says that you have two of those tools to put back. Okay. Nope, oh, that's not it. 
Where are you, weird? Maintenance room. Is this it? Nope, that's Aiden's room again. How do I get back to the maintenance wing now? I don't know. All the all the hallways look the same. I think you're on your way back. Nope, this doesn't look familiar. This is something else. This is Aiden's locker. Why does it have a... <gasps> oh my gosh, you could open it up! Don't see how. It's kind of like that thing when you sign into Google and you have to do that thing with your finger to open it up. I don't know his password. You could guess. There's like hundreds of combinations. You could be here all day. That's true. Besides, the password is supposed to be hammer. <gasps> Maybe you make it look like a hammer. What's that? Oh, that person. That's someone else's password. Oh. Ooh, they have tools in there. Whoa. There's nothing you can click on in here except for... Oh, a boot. It's not a boot. Don't know what that is. It doesn't tell you. Maybe that's a firing thing, a synapsis, or... It's like a battery of some kind. That's a boot. Yep. But yeah, this is uh, basically what this game is. Oh, I mean, can we're... I... Oh, oh, I'm sorry. What were you, you were gonna you were gonna stop? I'm I sorry. was gonna tell people we're gonna be done after an hour. It's been 47 minutes. Oh you want to run around? Go for How it. How many more codes do you have to give away? I gotta give away the next code. Do you want me to? Do you want me to randomly select somebody or? I'm gonna do it. Okay. All right, guys. Luke is gonna randomly select someone for the next code. Um, I don't know if we're dead or alive in this game or not. Well, you're obviously something because you're moving around. Sorry. Well, I'll just I can go I can go get some errands done and I can let let you just do this, I'm sorry. Alright, well I'm just gonna try this thing for Aiden and then I'll give it back to you. Is that okay or Yeah, I don't really care anymore, but because I feel like we could at least get something done. But I'm not sure. I think it might be something you have to really... Whoa, this place is so fancy. Yeah, I get lost here really easily. Oh, this is where we were. Is that the robot? No. Maintenance. Oh, well there is a map, but I don't know how to get back to the map. Oh my goodness. I think we're, yeah, we're on the other side of the ship now. <sighs> Alright guys. We're moving this random object. Yeah, so I wish that it, one thing I wish about this game is I wish it would identify the objects. Yeah. Okay. So, this is what I'm talking about. See how these things are signed out. We can put some of those things back. Like, okay, we can go grab them from over here. We have one of the objects. There. Let's see if I can put this back. And if I can't, then I have no idea what to do. <gasps> Yay! I was able to put one back, and maybe then we can get that if we're able to put the rest. So good job, Anthony. For that that's what I was talking about, and it, and I think a couple people in the chat were trying to say. Let's see, so we could grab this. Isn't this fun, Kiwi? Hey Dario, you still watching? 
Uh, we just need two more. Okay, if we can find those other two objects, we can get this. This really isn't my type of game, but, you know, if you guys want to check it out on Steam, there is a discount for it in the description of this video, and so far we have given away a couple copies of this game, so, for the PS4. I think it takes patience. And we just need one more. Because you already brought that over here. Maybe I can pick this up? No, that's not going to work. This is not going to work. No. It's not going to work. That's not working. I need something that looks like that. If we can find that, it'll be a miracle. Alright, I'm gonna look for it. I'm gonna race around here trying to find that thing. Usually that noise that happened when you put that away, that was a bad noise, so that means that thing that you put in there isn't going to work. Two of those worked, two of them clicked, the other one didn't. Oh. Well, how do I get to Aiden's room, or... Uh... I don't know. Uh, guys, tomorrow there is a live stream of Monster Hunter Stories. It's been about two weeks, but there's a new episode tomorrow. It'll be in the evening. Oh, here's his room. It's really close. Okay, so we just have to find the other object. So his room is actually really close to the... I want to grab this guy! You can't. I want to bring this. Alright. Oh, this is showing how you attach the arm. You can't attach the arm right now because it's not clickable. Can only do the things that it allows you to click on. Okay. That's how point and clicks work. So clicking on an object like that arm is just a waste of time because it's not going to work. Well, I want to click on it. Too bad, so sad. Ooh, I have an object. All right, I got this object. I'm bringing it in. I'm leaving it on here. It could be useful. Oh, we can use it for the robot. All right, I'm gonna go try to find the, the other object we need. I'm not giving up. Why isn't it going onto the robot? Because it's not a piece for the robot. <gasps> Is this something? Why would you be taking that out of the robot station if it was... Oh. Oh, never mind, never mind. Okay. That's probably something for the robot. Alright, alright, alright. I'll give it back to the robot. Okay, well, this is kind of hard because you have to find things. No, no. It put it inside the robot. What? Oh, I messed it up. Probably. It was there. No, you would... If it works with the robot, it will click. If not... It was just lying on the ground over right, here. Right, but sometimes in point-and-click games, there are things nearby for the robot. Oh. Uh, Alright, well, I'm Putting just... it on the floor is not going to stick it inside the robot. It wasn't inside the robot, though. No, I... It doesn't work with a robot. Did you try to push it on it? Mm. Now you know it doesn't work. Now you can drop it. Oh, okay. Alright. I'm going to go try to find Aiden's last piece. Why is it frustrating? This game is called The Station. It is a point-and-click space uh, survival game. Adventure. No, survival. All right. And we gave away two copies of the game so far. We have one more copy. I think this is important. Oh, that 
stop working. Wait, where did it go? I just had it in my hand. Oh. What? Oh my gosh. Just had it in my hand. Oh, it was like a futuristic wrench. I just had it. Oh, what? It's like losing my phone. I just had it and then it just left my hand. Alright, Luke, I am going to conquer this game. No, you're not because yes. it's, the stream is ending in 10 minutes. No, I'm you done. have to give away another code though. I'm giving away another code right now. No, I'm going to fix it before 10 minutes. Mm -mm. Yes, I am. I'm finding the last piece. Never give up. Ooh, he has a nice chair. Okay. So how is the music to this game? Because I can't hear anything. There is no music. Oh, because I have, like, the music of Perry the Platypus in my head. Dooby dooby doo ba doo. Alright, people. So the last winner uh, on our Twitter is... Hashtag. Oh, that's D guards. All right, here you go, D guards. I don't know what hashtag S O G means, but I like the the picture you got there. So follow message, and here you go. Oh, I found another piece. Alright, we have to find something. Can Amber finish this game before K-Wing shuts off? Nope, you can't. Alright, I sent out the last code. So, that is pretty much going to do it for the stream, people. This is a adventure game, point and click, uh, that doesn't tell you what to do, really. But, uh, if you like that kind of, um game then that is for you uh we have a discount available for the game right now if you have steam yep click on the link in the description and this game released yesterday on the uh, ps4 and steam but uh, that's gonna wrap things up tomorrow's live stream is monster hunter stories where we'll be continuing uh the plot of the game and uh, there'll also be a fire emblem stream on Saturday for Echoes, where we'll be facing the, or not, yeah, Echoes, we'll be facing the Crazy Queen. Um, thanks so much for taking the time to watch. That concludes the hour look at this game. Tomorrow is another episode of Scribble Knots, and also starts the showcase of Chrono Blade, which uh, maybe some of you played that when it used to be a Facebook game. It is now coming to Android and iOS. Thanks again to uh, Freedom MCN for sending a copy of this game. And the developers for doing the discount and giving away PS4 copies. I hope you guys have an awesome rest of your night. And until we meet again, God bless and happy gaming. Thanks so much for watching. See ya!